For you formed my inward parts. You knitted me together in my mother's womb. My frame was not hidden from you. When I was being made in secret, intricately woven in the depths of the earth, your eyes saw my unformed substance. In your book were written, every one of them, the days that were formed for me, when as yet there was none of them. Conception is an act of God, an act in which 23 chromosomes from a father and 23 chromosomes from a mother come together in a strip of DNA that makes a life. And at the moment of that physical coming together, God, then by the agency of His Holy Spirit, breathes a soul, an immortal, eternal soul that transcends the body, for it will live forever. At conception, you have life. To kill that life is to play God. And as serious an affront as it is against the life itself, it is a more serious one against God, who is the Creator. We have usurped the sovereign throne, and we are now God and we will determine who lives and who dies. And this is spilling over into euthanasia, which is coming like a hurricane to wash away our whole old population, because we're God now, and we'll decide. Abortion then becomes a violent anti-God act. It is not only a murder of the individual, it is an affront to the Creator.